Okay, late start today, guys. So we're gonna stop and get some lunch at Hip Hop Chicken. Yeah, kept the um, pick two combo, um, chicken gizzards and chicken wings. Yeah, that'll be it. Thank you. All right, thank you so much. All right, you too. All right, just got our food. Let me show you guys what they're serving at Hip Hop Chicken and Fish. And I got the pick two. Got fried chicken wings and some fried gizzards. Comes with fries and that crack sauce on top. So delicious. Now I'm going to head to the fishing spot. And I'll probably just munch on this on the way there since I got a little bit of drive ahead of me. Alright, we are here, finally. That was a long drive. I finished all my food. I'll have plenty of energy to do plenty of hiking. And we are now on the trails. I'm out here in Northeast Florida, close to the border of Florida and Georgia, actually. A buddy of mine told me about this trail system, which partly runs along this saltwater creek. He said the fishing could be really good at times, so that's what I'm doing. Never been here before, so it's gonna be all exploring, all hiking, and once we see some water, we'll start doing some casting. I have my usual artificials, but I also brought some dead shrimp today. Hopefully that increases our odds of catching something. I think right now it's just started the outgoing tide, so it should be a good time to start fishing. Other than that, super windy. So hopefully all these trees will give us some nice wind cover and allow us to fish comfortably. But we'll see. Thanks for joining me on another video, guys. Let me go ahead and make my way. Got a long way to go. And I'll see you guys when we get there. guys are but I'm really into the missing 411 David Pallades series about people going missing in places like this usually they're by themselves in the woods hiking and in every case there's just no explanation for these disappearances it's a little bit spooky because I'm the only one out here no one was in the parking area no cars no other hikers it's just me in the wilderness we'll just stay on this trail and not do anything crazy Hopefully nothing dangerous is out here. All right, let's keep going ahead. Wow, look up ahead. I think we hit the jackpot as far as locations. What the hell? This is amazing. Man, I bet you nobody hikes back here. Wow, man, we gotta catch fish right here. Check that out, guys. It's amazing, heck yeah. Now let's hope we catch some fish. Let's throw some artificials real quick. First cast, brand new spot. Outgoing tide, water's moving pretty fast. Yeah, let's try dead shrimp. Crazy. Just going with a Carolina rig, one ounce egg sinker, and little pieces of dead shrimp. Just throw it out in the middle of the creek. Current may take it, not sure. The bottom feels really good though. Lots of shells.
think I just had a bite, guys. Let's see. Fish, guys. First fish. What is it? Oh, it's a blue. Okay, easy, buddy. Easy. Got like little saltwater piranha. Let's try another spot guys. Only one fish here. At least we didn't skunk. But my Carolina rig broke off and I didn't bring any extra tackle. Only jig heads. So from this point going forward it's only jig heads. Alright let's go. We might come back to this spot a little bit later when the tide slows down a little bit. But for now let's go explore. up ahead there's a creek oh they found it Whew. that was a long walk let's fish down here first still outgoing tide it looks like current flow looks real good right here gotta be some fish let's go onto the bridge and maybe go to the other side whoa the place looks awesome Can get a pretty good view from up here you might even see fish swimming around I got that water coming out of that little creek mouth. Gotta be fish staged up outside of there. Oh, oysters. Good sign. Let's cast right in front of that creek mouth. Right there. Okay. Nothing. Definitely a slow day so far. Hopefully at the end of the low tide it changes. I think it is kind of close to the full moon. So that's not a good sign either. Let's come down here. Looks pretty good too. Any fish? I don't know. Let's stop right here. Okay, nothing here. Had one chase to lure, didn't bite it. So I'm gonna keep going. Hopefully our luck changes soon. I think after this, we're gonna go back to that first spot. It just looked really good. Especially when that current slows down, that bite should turn on. That's what I think, but who knows. a flounder oh, fish on guys fish on yeah, right in front of that sandbar feels decent 
it's not a keeper but just like I was thinking you should be fishing for that sandbar that's where he was there he is little guy let's get him back That's it guys, let's go back to the first spot. Got a long walk. All right, working my way back to that amazing first spot. We didn't get a lot of bites over there, but maybe now that the tide is about to slow down and turn around, we need to be right there at that certain time. The bridge is okay. I mean, we did get one fish, one bite. I didn't fish it too long because I didn't want to miss the opportunity back at the first spot, but it might be worth coming back to later on. So I'm making my way there. See you guys in a bit when we get there. We made it back. Let's try dead shrimp again. Oh, good one. Good one. Decent fish. Decent fish. I don't know where he's going. Come on, stay on. Stay on, baby. That has to be a red. Oh yeah, decent red. Oh. oh yeah, that's a keeper. Oh check that out. Check that out guys. I would guess that's a lower slot, right around 18 probably. Toss them in. Ready, bud? There you go. Oh. <laughs> Hell yeah. Got one. I should have brought a towel. Oh, closer to me anyways. I think it's only going to get better as the tide turns around. So let's keep fishing. almost 5 30 plenty of daylight left but i got a long hike back to the car to the truck and a long drive home 
tired overall i think it's a pretty good place action was slow though really only three bites all day and i landed all three could be the weather could be the moon phase combination of all that but it's probably worth a return trip one day so i'll try to do that in the future but not anytime soon overall worth it just to hike these trails i mean it's beautiful out here and it's pretty much untouched it's always a great time to explore the outdoors and if i catch fish it's a huge bonus Man, I am tired. Right, thanks for joining me on another adventure, guys. We're going to do it again real soon. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.